the center at New York Medical College has a large impact on both the community and companies. We help the community prepare for disasters, terrorism, and mass casualty events, training EMS, law enforcement, fire services, but also businesses, schools, hospitals, how to prepare and respond. We have rooms set up to mimic what might be a bomb making facility, a meth lab, and we have mannequins that simulate actual patients. They talk to you, they bleed. We have a sensory overload and deprivation room, and sometimes you may go into an area with no sound, no vision, and get lost, and then other times you may have different distractions. And so under fire and in these very difficult rooms and situations, law enforcement, EMS, and fire learn how to protect the public, protect themselves, and provide medical care to those who need it. Our research helps in multiple ways. At the basic science research level, it's really designing antidotes and countermeasures to terrorism or chemical agents. But also it's an applied research which is saying when you have a mass casualty event of hundreds of people showing up at a hospital, how does the hospital manage those patients? How do they creatively use their medical technologies in novel ways to be able to respond appropriately? One of the great things we're able to do at New York Medical College Center for Excellence, and this really resonates with me as a pediatrician of former first responder, is we're providing people the tools to prevent issues such as disaster terrorism, but even more importantly, once some of those events happen, it can make the difference between someone being saved and someone not being saved. Having a police officer, an EMS, a firefighter who can go into these complex situations, provide medical care, and bring someone out and save their life is one of the great things we're able to do.